Hi, welcome to Gatum Lab Tutorials for adding data domain to Avamar. First, let's start by configuring our data domain. Log in with sysadmin and the password change me. Accept the EULA and set a new password. Enter your host name. Enter your domain name. Configure your Ethernet port. Enter the IP address of your virtual machine, then your netmask. Enter the default gateway. Enter the DNS server IP. Save your configurations and head to the web GUI. Sign in and go to Administration. Settings. Create a trap host with the IP of your Avamar as host, port 163, and community string public. Go to data management and create a file system. Select the storage. Next, skip the cloud step. Next, choose ddboost or skip assessment and click on Finish. When done, head over to Protocols. Select DDBoost. Down at the bottom, create a user. In this case, we use the sysadmin for DDBoost. When done, enable DDBoost. Go back to the command line on your data domain and use the system passphrase set command. Enter a password. Now on the Evamar web GUI, log in and head over to the settings tab. Click on data domain, then click add. Enter the data domain's IP and the ddboost user information. Click on Validate. Next, enter your SNMP community string. Wait a moment. And that's how you add a data domain storage node to an Avamar. Thank you for watching. For more information, please contact us.